ஹரே கிருஷ்ணா வெல்கம் டு கிருஷ்ணாஸ் கியூஸ் அண்ட் ஐ எம் பூவன் சுந்தரி ராதா தேவிதாசி வித் சுஷீல பிரபுபதாஸ் ஃபேவரட் ரெசிபி த வெரி நெக்ஸ்ட் டே ஆஃப் ஜென்மாஷ்டமி இஸ் த டே ஆஃப் நந்தோத்சவ அண்ட் ஆல்சோ ஷீல பிரபுபாத அப்பியரன்ஸ் டே திஸ் இஸ் த டே அரவுண்ட் விச் ஆர் லைஃப்ஸ் ரிவால்வ் இட் இஸ் ஆர் சேவியர் ஷீல பிரபுபாதாஸ் அப்பியரன்ஸ் டே ஸோ ஆன் திஸ் ஆஸ்பிஷியஸ் டே வி ப்ரிப்பேர் மெனி டிஷ்ஷஸ் ஸ்பெஷலி விச் ஆர் பிரபுபாதாஸ் ஃபேவரட் ஒன்ஸ் So today let's prepare chidva this is a recipe shared by her grace yamuna devi dasi mata ji in her cookbook with the past time so let's listen to this wonderful past time shila prabhupada absolutely loved chidva a snack made with fried flat rice and shredded potatoes along with peanuts raisins and spices shruti rupa recalls how palika dasi would serve it to him for breakfast one morning after breakfast shila prabhupada told his servant this chidwa is killing me a phrase he used freely when a dish was not so good for his health the next day palika did not put the usual chidwa on his plate as soon as he sat down to breakfast prabhupada asked where is my chidwa palika replied shila prabhupada It was brought to my attention that you said the chidwa was making you sick. Nevertheless, he requested her to bring it immediately, and upon receiving the dish, he joked with a smile, "What can I do? It is too good. I can't stop eating it." Jai Shila Prabhupada. Thus, Prabhupada was so fond of this chidwa. So let's prepare it quickly. So first, take. 230 grams of potatoes and wash them let's peel it this is done next take some water in a big plate or bowl let's grate the potatoes with the larger side of the grater Similarly grate all the potatoes. Wash it for 2 to 3 times. Now add water and soak it for 1 hour. If you have cold water then use it. It has been 1 hour. Now take it out in a strainer. Keep it aside for 10 minutes. Meanwhile, let's prepare the masala. Take half teaspoon of turmeric powder. Add half teaspoon red chili powder. One teaspoon of salt. Add one tablespoon of powdered sugar. Mix it well. Our masala is ready. Keep it aside. Next, take a clean cloth and spread the grated potatoes and dry out the excess water. We have shared many Shila Prabhupada's favorite recipes, and you can find all in Prabhupada's favorite recipes playlist, which link has been shared in the description box below. Dry it for fifteen to twenty minutes. For chidwa take 1 plus 1/4 cups of thick flattened rice which we are using for alu poha then take 2/3 cup of peanuts and 1/2 cup of raisins it has dried enough let's fry it i have heated oil here keep the flame high only do not fill the full kadai with oil for fry After adding the potatoes it will come up so fill half or less than that Fry it on medium to high flame Stir this using a knife so that they do not stick together Fry them until they turn crispy and golden in color 
I have listed down all the ingredients with their measurements in the description box below. You can refer it. You can see here it has fried so well. Take it out into such a bowl so all the oil can drain out. Similarly fry all the shredded potatoes. Next add 2 third cup of peanuts. Fry them on low flame only until they turn crispy. It has fried well. Take it out. For flattened rice, make sure we need hot oil only. If you fry in warm or less hot oil, flattened rice will soak more oil and it will not become fluffy. Add some flattened rice. And after adding the poha, keep the flame low. Take it out in a bowl. Similarly fry all the flattened rice. Next add half a cup of raisins. Fry them on medium flame. The raisins should be fried only until they plump. Take it out in a plate. Next take 1 tablespoon of fennel seeds and half tablespoon of cumin seed. Fry them on low flame only. Take it out. Take 2 green chillies, cut them into half and fry them. Turn off the flame now. Now take a mixing bowl and add fried flattened rice. Add fried peanuts, fried raisins, fried fennel seeds and cumin seeds. Mix them gently. Add fried grated potatoes. Sprinkle masala that we have prepared. Combine all this gently. Add all the masala. Srila Prabhupada's favorite chidva is ready. You can store this for one month in an airtight container. Let's place a tulsi leaf and offer it to Lord Jagannath. The devotees of the Lord are released from all kinds of sins because they eat food which is offered first for sacrifice. Bhagavad Gita 3.13 if you like Boga offering recipes, please like, share, subscribe and click on the bell icon below so you do not miss any Boga recipe. Always chant Hare Krishna, Hare Krishna, Krishna Krishna, Hare Hare, Hare Ram, Hare Ram, Ram Ram, Ram Hare Hare and be happy.